you were wondering what NFBs were. Non-fungible bangers. We call them NFBs, where we take like, you know, chat messages and you can roll for them and claim ownership of one. NFBs are really funny though. You, yeah, you, you, it's a money sink for your channel points. You roll for it and you get ownership of something crazy that was said in the chat. You get to own that chat message. Oh my God, wait, Firaxis? Oh, wait, this is a banger. Hold on. It's got this combo. I want to show you this, this beautiful combo that he owns. <laughs> Firaxis owns this NFB. Markiplier offers food from his palm, do you? And then the poll winning answer was eat and suck the fingies. During which time Ryuko said, this isn't the first time I dreamed about Markiplier hand feeding me. What the f*** is this? <laughs> what is that? When did this happen? I like remember it, but I don't. I don't know. Is this a fever dream? I can't tell. Is that the sensual lick of 87? Oh my God. You know, at some point I realized like I'm in a room full of girls talking, okay? Room full of girls talking. At some point, some girl says something about Markiplier. Now, I did not realize that a lot of women liked Markiplier like that. I was like, yeah, he makes videos for kids about horror games. Like that was that was it in my mind, right? Someone says something about Markiplier, another girl goes, oh yeah, like that, oh yeah. And I was like, oh. and then they all chime in. They're like, oh, Markiplier. I was like, what? <laughs> Not that I like don't see it. I was just like, what? I don't know. It's so fucking funny though. I was just like, I didn't realize that he was like drowning in pussy apparently. Not saying that he takes up those offers. I'm just saying like he could be, you know, that's crazy. I didn't know. He said, I wish I had his voice. I'd be unstoppably hot. Is his voice that nice? I have to like listen to it. Hold on. Wait, let's, let's listen to Markiplier's voice. Here's him. Okay. Streamed one day ago. 1.2 million views on a live stream. I, I forget that this dude is like, that's crazy. Okay. Wait, we're going to listen to Markiplier say words. We're kind of uh, holding uh, a council to determine what the best path forward is. He just sounds like a normal dude. Like, <laughs> I'm not trying to talk down on, on Markiplier's name, but I just... <laughs> This sounds like a normal guy to me. Oh, let's get bad. Let's get bad. Way down. It's a long row of windows. I see a head go. Doink. Is that what you're into? <laughs> Doink. Is that, is that what you like, Chad? <laughs> Doink. <laughs> Oh my god, Mark, when you say doink, that goes crazy. So it's just deep, but not too deep. The Goldilocks man voice. Mmm. I don't, I don't get it. I think they're all fine. <laughs> I think all of the voices are fine. There's a lot of bass to his voice and that's the key. Okay, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm pausing the BGM. I'm pausing the BGM. We, I gotta really listen to this. They look at me like I'm not. I, I, okay, I can hear, I can hear there's bass in his voice, but it's nothing like insane, right? There are people that have like, a, I think this is like a moderate bass and then there are people with like a little less and most people are within this range. Play the doink again. <laughs> you just want to listen to the doink, you sicko. <laughs> okay, we'll listen to it again. Way down. It's a long row of windows. I see a head go, doink. <laughs> Play it again. Play it over and over. You people are sick. Y'all make me sick. What do you mean getting my doink on? <laughs> you feel like his voice is higher pitched than it used to be? Maybe it's when he's streaming, his mic isn't close to his mouth. Wait, actually, this is a good point. Hold on. By myself in a, in a warehouse for a month in the heat and I love- I think when he's streaming, he's, he's turned away from his mic a little bit so you lose some of the bass. I loved every part of it and there were some terrible days and I hate He's also, <laughs> okay, so this is something that's like really interesting that I only realized when I started streaming. When you're talking to chat, most people raise their voice up a little bit and they are like feeling like they're speaking to an audience. So they feel like they need to project their voice. Not everyone does this, but a lot of streamers do it. I'm one of those. I'm one of those. I'm actually like, I project my voice on stream a lot, which I might not sound like it, but I have like <laughs> naturally a pretty quiet voice, to be honest. So like when I feel like I'm talking to a lot of people, I, I tend to just project my voice a little more. And this is what you get, which is crazy because then when I'm not projecting my voice, I sound like I'm dying. I said, everyone's like, are you sick? Are you okay? And I'm like, no, I, my voice is just like that. <laughs> this is how it is. But then when I record something, it's harder for me to project my voice like that because I feel like I'm not speaking to an audience the same way because it's not live. Right? So when you project less, yeah, there's more bass, exactly. So it's one of those things and you don't realize you're doing it, it just happens. It's a natural occurrence as you're kind of like just presenting information to a different crowd. And I can tell that he's doing that. And, and I think most YouTubers do that. You're used to hearing people as just YouTubers or just as streamers, but people that do both, you'll see it a lot. 